Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna do a quick unboxing of the Blue Vivo XL Plus. Now you can pick this up on Amazon. I'll throw the link up in the description. The price on this one, 280 bucks. Now trust me when I tell you, this is Blue's best phone to date. Wait until you see the specs. All right, so let's check this out. Shout out to White Shoes back in the building. Blue Vivo XL Plus. First things first, look at the presentation. Kind of looks like a Michelangelo painting. I like that. Y'all ready for the specs? Bang, check this out. You got a 6.2 inch full HD plus all screen design. Now for the processor, it's a MediaTek Helio P60, that's octa-core, clocked in at 2.0 gigahertz. Check this out. 128 gigs worth of storage and six gigs of RAM. Under 300 bucks. Now for the rear cameras, you got a dual setup. One is 16 megapixels, the other one is five megapixels. That's gonna give you portrait mode. On the front, you got a 16 megapixel camera. <laughs> now pay attention. Wireless charging. Let's take a second to let that sink in. Under 300 bucks, shout out to Blue. We finally got a phone with wireless charging for under 300 bucks. Now we're not done yet. Now you got 3D True Death Face ID. So you got Face ID and wireless charging and a portrait mode camera, under 300 bucks. You also got an advanced security fingerprint sensor. You got a micro SD card slot for expandable memory up to 128 gigs. So that's gonna give you a total of 256 gigs worth of storage. Now it's 4G LTE Cat7 high speed data up to 300 MIBs. All right, that's a lot of MIBs. And it's running Android 8.1 Optimus Prime, fresh out of the box. All of that for under 300 bucks. This is crazy. All right, let me grab a little unboxing knife. What we got today? Spider-Man, let's check this out. Rah, here we go. Now, I'm still a little bit under the weather, so bear with me, y'all. Look at this box. I might have to save this for the collection. Here we go. Blue Vivo XL Plus. Let's see what you get inside. Now, here's your device. Follow that sticker. Little screen sticker, rah. One more on the back, let me just peel this off for the dramatic effect, rah. Woo, look at this. Soon as I said look at this, white shoes, you know, you know what time it is. Shoes, check this out. On the back, there's your dual camera setup, fingerprint sensor. This is sick. Let's power this up, see if we got any juice. Woo, look at that. Now, shout out to the notch. It's nacho cheese in the building. Let's see what else you get. Okay, so no headphone jack. So this is gonna be your dongle, USB type C. Under 300 bucks, so far we winning. Here's your USB type C charging cable. File that to the side. Now you get a set of headphones. Let's just pop these open real quick. Set of headphones. Now this is cool. Comes with the dongle and headphones. Let's see what else. Here's your charging brick. Shoes can't wait to get in the box. Sim ejection tool. Got a little bit of poison for the trolls. Let me file that into my back pocket. Let's see, you got your usual books and shit. Pluck them, file them to the side. You got your blue troll sticker. Now this is kind of dope. Matches the box. I like those little details. And you get a case, we're not done yet. You get a case. Let's open this up and see what it looks Oh my God, I can't believe it, hold on a second. Say it ain't so, look at the case. Look at the case. Now I'm into all of this uh, old school kind of stuff, but this looks sick. All right, shout out to Blue, I'm feeling that. I hope this sticker comes off. Let me play with that in a second. Let's see what else you get. Another case. All right, so you got two cases, just in case you ain't into the Michelangelo artwork. You got a uh, regular transparent style case. I'm going with this one. And you get a screen protector. Now let's see what kind of screen protector this is. Ah! Okay, I think I just broke it. Oh no, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. 
Now it's a plastic screen protector. I may have just broke it. I think I broke it. Well, since I already broke it, ah! It was a tempered glass screen protector, which I immediately broke because I got heavy hands, but it is what it is. Back to the phone. Whoo, look at this. Let's get a little wipe down for that dramatic effect. Look at that shine. Keep in mind, this has wireless charging under 300 bucks. All right, so let me pause the video. I'll drop my information in, then we'll breeze through the OS. Talk amongst yourselves. All right, y'all, so we back in. Now, I just put my information in the phone. I've been playing around with it for a few minutes, and I gotta be honest with y'all. Like I said at the beginning of the video, this is easily Blue's best phone to date for under 300 bucks. On a scale of one to 10, this is a major, major, major go. Check this out. Wireless charge on deck. And you get a nice little animation. I'm feeling that. First things first, build quality. Let me get a little wipe down for dramatic effect. Woo, look at that. The phone just looks and feels premium. Has that beautiful shine to it. Y'all know I gotta say it. Feels good in the hands. Ladies, you know the procedures. Kinda looks like an iPhone. The build quality is A1. You're gonna like this one. Now there's a couple of different ways you can open up the device. You can swipe up, use your pattern. That's standard. You can use your fingerprint sensor. You see how fast that was? No lag, nice and smooth. Works 100% of the time. But the best way to open up this phone is using the facial unlock. Now this has an ambient wake screen. Now I'm looking away. So once you lift up the phone, it automatically activates the display. Now I'm gonna do the same thing while looking at it. Did y'all see that? Let me do that one more time. All right, you see all my fingers. I'm just gonna pick up the phone while looking at it. Right to the home screen. That is a major go. So far, fresh out of the box, no lag. There's your Google, got all your apps, got your notifications. Let's go through the basic toggles. You got your mobile data, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, flashlight, sound, vibrate. You got super screenshots. All right, that's your scroll shot. Airplane mode, do not disturb. Location, auto rotate. You got extreme power saving mode, calculator, alarm. You got screen recorder and camera. Now for a lot of people, y'all remember when I did the Galaxy Note 9 review? Screen recorder right on the toggles. That's what I'm talking about. Now I got this on max brightness. So far the viewing angles look pretty good. I gotta take it out in the sunlight, but inside it looks great. Let's go through all of the settings. Let's see, you got your cellular networks. One thing I did notice, no NFC, but it is what it is. Let's see, you got your Bluetooth. We'll leave that off. Here we go. Tethering and you got a hotspot. Let's go to more. Standard, like I said, no NFC. Let's go to display settings. All right, you got adaptive brightness. I always leave that off. I like maximum brightness because I'm a scumbag. You got economical bright light, uh, <laughs> bright light, economical backlight. I automatically adjust the backlight to save power. I'm a battery hog, so I'll leave that off. You got switch screen display area. Let's click that. Now I'll play with these settings in a minute. Let's see, you got your font size, wallpaper, LCD effect. Okay, you got neutral, uh, cool color, and warm color. Let's see what cool looks like. All right, cool is a little bit blue. Warm is a little bit yellowish. Let's leave it on neutral. You got smart eye protection. Let's see, uh, yeah, okay, that's basically doing it manually. And you can set the time that you use it for. Leave it on nice and cool. Let's see what else you got. Screencast, and you got full screen mode. We'll leave, uh, we gotta download some more apps for that. Let's keep it moving. Navigation bar, now if you want, if you like to have your back button on the right instead of the left, you can swap that if you want. You can also hide the buttons. They'll totally disappear. Then whenever you wanna use it, you just gotta swipe up. And you got your notch colors. We'll, we'll leave that blend in with the apps. Let's see, sound and vibration. Let's get maximum. Now this is, one thing I, I gotta say too, the speaker on this is loud. I'm gonna play some music in a second. Speaker's nice and loud though. Y'all hear how loud that is? And that's one speaker coming out the bottom. Let's see what else we got. Let's go to our, we don't need to go to notifications, do not disturb. All right, security. 
Now you do have smart lock. Let's go through that real quick. Standard lock screen uh, pattern. All right, so you got on body trusted places, trusted device, and voice match. You don't need to face uh, smart lock because this has face unlock already. Fingerprint sensors, all that good stuff. Let's see what else we got. Let's go to our more settings. Okay, smart gestures, here we go. All right, so you got raise to wake. That's the ambient rate screen. Let's see, you got our black screen gestures. So while the screen is off, we'll draw a circle. Let's make sure we do that right. Activate the flashlight. Deactivate the flashlight. Now, I just like doing this, raising up the screen and looking right at the phone. Like doing that. All right, let's see what else you got. Uh, smart vibration reminder. This way, if you get a notification, as soon as you pick up your phone, it'll vibrate, let you know you missed a call or a text, whatever you got. Smart bright screen, double click to wake up. All right, so we leave all that stuff, that's standard. You got your glove mode. Nice amount of features on this. And that's pretty much it. Let's just go to about, just for fun. Let's go to uh, Android version. Oh, you can see it right here. I'm not gonna do that little corny game. 8.1 Optimus Prime. Now check this out, let's go over to YouTube. Hold this down. You do got split screen multitasking. But let's check the uh, speaker and the display. Let's go over to full screen. Look at this. Listen to this. This screen looks great though. Now this is one speaker at the bottom. Listen. I'm genuinely impressed with the speaker on this. It's pretty loud. You would think that once you cover it up, it fully disappears, that it's not that loud, but it's actually nice. All right, let's see, let's go to camera. Let's see, let's go to the uh, modes. You got professional, time-lapse, slow motion, and your group selfies. You got your flash. You got all your Instagram filters. That's these, actually. Exit out of that. This is your portrait mode. That's how you activate it. Let's go to settings and see what we got. Capture mode, auto scene, sound. All right, clandestine photos alert. Turn that off. Got your guidelines, geotagging, countdown, picture size, maximum 16 megapixels. Where was we? All right, volume keys, and you got restore. Now from the bottom, you got, let's go through all of the different modes. You got night mode, you got video, face beauty, photo, backlight, panoramic, and you got your group selfies. Now real quick, check this out, I did a little photo Look at the shoes. Now this is the portrait mode. Looks beautiful. This is actually pretty good. Let's do a quick point and shoot. Let's go to regular photo mode. Let's get that Michelangelo box. All right, let's see how this looks. All right, so regular photo. Looks good. Let's do that same photo, but in portrait mode. Let me see if I can get a nice blurry background. Just like that. Let that load up. And there's your background. Not too blurred out on this one, but you can adjust the settings. We gotta play with it. But just point and shoot mode, this looks pretty good. And like I said, you got pro mode. One more thing, let's take it over to the internet. Let's go to our, one of our favorite websites. Let's go to apple.com. See how fast this loads up. Look at that load speed. Now this is the full website with all of the pictures. Under 300 bucks. Oh, well, let me see, what was that? September 12th. All right, cool, lock that in. Overall, fresh out of the box on a scale of one to 10 for under 300 bucks. This is a major, major, major go. Even the OnePlus 6 doesn't have wireless charging. Even the HTC U12 Plus doesn't have wireless charging. This has wireless charge and facial unlock. Let's do that again. Now I'm sitting from behind the camera. I think something might be obstruct obstructing my view. 
or it's either that or I'm so, oh, my bad. <laughs> I'm sweating like crazy. I'm a little bit under the weather. Here we go. I had to wipe but Okay, that's one thing. We have to play with this. It seems like the facial unlock had a little glitch just now, but working again. Keep in mind, fellas, under 300 bucks. I could do that all day. Anyway, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. And if there's anything y'all want me to cover when I do the full review, let me know. Oh, one more thing too. Let's drop the Michelangelo case on. That's what we call in this case. Check this out. Now these are stickers. I could peel them off, but I noticed it was a little bit, I was a little bit of sticker struggles. So I'm gonna let that rock for a minute. This is so dope. Ladies, fellas, you got kids. They want an iPhone 10. You ain't got that iPhone 10 bread. This is the next best thing. Or oh, you're looking for a nice little trap phone that actually works and actually has features and actually has wireless charge. This is it right here. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time. 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know. Stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat, Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad, I see y'all in the comment section early, hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing, I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls. Close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Spock won the beam up. Energize.